On the track, 20-year-old Michaela Moore is fast, very fast. What does it feel like to go that fast on a motorcycle? Um, I like, I enjoy it actually. It's like a sense of, as some would say, freedom. This is the first race of last year's Moto America Build Train Race Series, sponsored by motorcycle manufacturer Royal Enfield. Michaela led the whole race and won easily. That first race was actually a lot because I told myself this is what I dreamed to be, you know, getting a podium in Motor America and to be able to do it my first year of professional racing was meant something to me. And what happened in the second race? Race two, um, I think the gap may have been maybe a little shorter. But you won again your second race. I did. Race. And race three, race four, race five, race six, and race seven. You won every race yeah, the whole I did. season. I did. That's amazing. It is, yeah. You must be very proud. I am. Everyone's proud of me. I'm proud of myself. As Michaela is out there bringing home trophies, she's also representing the sport as one of the few female African-American motorcycle racers. Do I stand out? Sure. But at the same time, you know, I feel like I'm just that star that's shining because everyone's trying to figure out who I am, what I'm about. She says she's been warmly welcomed by the racing community. They see me, they're like, oh my gosh, like, it's so cool to see you here because, you know, we don't see much of you guys out here, not alone just being a woman of color, but just women in general racing. Michaela has been riding motorcycles since she was six and racing since she was 12, supported by her family and in particular, her father, Will. I just wanted to keep it fun. Um, but over the years, looking at her talent and realizes this is something she actually truly wants to do, the gear started to change. Will Moore runs this motorcycle shop and riding school outside Washington, D.C. It's now home base for Michaela's racing career. Will hopes her success on the track will help change perceptions around race in the United States. So I feel like Michaela will create or recreate a different perspective and narrative as, as to how our culture is addressed. Because when they see Michaela, the, the color's obvious, but what you see is, man, that is a good spirited person. She's a sweetheart, you know, she's humble. Sweet, humble, and fast. And fast. She hopes her success on the track inspires others. What's your message for people of color who wanna try something in a space where people of color aren't usually seen? My message to anyone is just, if your heart tells you to go for something, I would say do it because in, the reward will be better. Michaela will compete in the Build Train Race series again this year and hopes to eventually race in Europe. Jim Spellman, CGTN, Clinton, Maryland.